Razorback Approach on 126.6. Rogers Executive Airport, Carter Field. Automated weather observation. One, three, three, one, Zulu. Wind, two, three, zero, at zero, six. Visibility, one, zero. Sky condition, clear. Temperature, minus zero, three, Celsius. Dew point, minus zero, seven, Celsius. Altimeter, two, niner, niner, eight. Remarks? Rogers Tower, hours of operation are 5.30. All right, two, nine, nine, eight. Three, five, three, two, five. All right, ASOS in there. Stratus Ahars zeroed out. All right, we're ready to go. Take off checklist. Make sure we'll go full rich. Oil and pressure check. Let's reset our fuel. I filled it up yesterday. off. We don't need that. Need any lights on this morning except for beacon. Sunrise just happened a few minutes ago. Did add some fuel the other day. I filled her up yesterday and I had to add some oil as well. So that oil temperature gets up this morning. My wife and the dog behind us. He's got his headphones on. Hilarious. Dog gets a trip out of flying. He loves it. Get down here, do a run up, set our approach flaps are good. I mean, you know what? I think we need to turn around and go back the other way. We went the wrong way on the taxi.
Uh, so we'll do that. Real slight wind this morning, not too big. We'll give the motor a few minutes extra to warm. Always better to do things safe than sorry. My defroster up on high, but it still gets a little, a little moist. So we got Rogers Tower in the software computer there. Six, which would be the Razorback approach. Once I get airborne, I'll contact them next. Our flight control checks. Everything's free and clear. Yes. All right, everybody's buckled in. Let's go ahead and get our run up started here while we're taxiing. Go to 1700. Our left mag check. That looks real good. Right mag check. That also looks real good. We'll go to 2000, untie the buses, and check the prop. All right, buses untied. Up cycle's good, and oil on the windscreen. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. We'll set our heading bug for one way two zero. Hope everybody's had a beautiful morning. Hope you get the chance to fly a little bit. <clears throat> it's always tough in the winter when flying because of the icing conditions. I'm an IFR rated pilot, but that doesn't make a hill of beans if you're flying in the winter time in the clouds. You really can't do that not without any anti-icing equipment, which you don't have. Rogers area traffic, Bonanza 6980, Bravo, holding short 20. Got a little bit of traffic crossing my takeoff corridor here, so we're going to wait a second. Let's go by. That's a 840 Mike Charlie. That's a training aircraft out of uh, Bentonville's airport, which I've flown many times. Got off the runway at the moment. <clears throat> All right, final checks. Looks good. Pressure looks good. Oils and temperatures look good. Auxiliary fuel pump is off. Fuel flow is going to be full at 35 gallons. Oil pressure is good and within range. Temperatures look good. Lights, takeoff lights are off. Rogers area traffic. Bonanza 6980 Bravo taking runway 20 to the northwest. Right turn out. Bravo 
get a fuel flow warning here in just a second. There that warning is. Our 70 knots, start our rotation. Positive rate, gear up. Out damper on. Flight director heading autopilot, flight level change. We're going to shoot for 120 coming off. Push flaps up, looking for that traffic. Rogers area traffic, Bonanza 6980 Bravo, just off Rogers 23, turning northwest. Final call, Rogers. Good morning, Razorback Approach, Bonanza 6980 Bravo, just off Rogers. 1900, climbing 4.5. Razorback Approach, Bonanza 6980, Bravo. Bonanza 6980, Bravo, Razorback, go ahead. Yeah, just off Rogers, uh, we're about 24-4, climbing 4.5, headed to uh, India X-ray Delta. I'd like to pick up radar services, DFR, please. The 6980 Bravo Rogers Clark 5644 in Ident, the Drake altimeter 2999. 5644 Ident 2999, 80 Bravo, thank you. And Bravo radar contact one mile southwest of Rogers Airport, proceed on course, stay altitude. On course, passing through 3100, heading to 4.5. Roger, thank you. Upside down this morning with my iPad. Razorback, 8510 Papa at 2500. And is it 8510 Papa or 851 Sierra Papa? 851 Sierra Papa. 851 Sierra Papa, I didn't Drake altimeter 2999. Eight five one zero Papa radar contact four miles north northeast of the Benville Airport. Proceed on course. Oh, now going to your Papa. I right, just did the tank switch over there. In fifteen minutes, we have an alert set up for that. Helps us know when to switch them. All right, check our climbing checklist because we're about at altitude already. Power set, RPM set, mixture switch for now. Auxiliary of the food pump. We're not going to use it because we're not going to five thousand. All right, all our temps look good. Everything looks. Good. Go ahead and settle in at 4,500 feet here. We're going to bring the RPMs back to 2,500. We're going to leave wide open the throttle. We're going to bring our fuel flow down to about 15 and a half. It's a brisk morning out, nice and chilly. Line characteristics are going to be great. However, we've got a 32 knot wind right in our face. Which isn't fantastic. A little traffic over here to my left. I'm going to cross under us. He's about 1,700 feet below us, so. though. Close them cow flaps, go for a cruise checklist, make sure that's complete, or set, auxiliary fuel pump is off, mixture set, 15 and off, and ITs look good at 14, 28. One and a half miles off my left wing here, we've got traffic I'm looking for.
Now they've passed under the wing. Won't be able to see them now, but uh, uh, we know they're over there. We can see them. All right. I got an hour and six minute flight, so we're going to get settled in, and we'll see you guys here shortly for our approach into X-ray Delta, which is in uh, Olathe, Kansas City. See you soon. Well, welcome back, uh, YouTube. This is uh, E36TN pilot. We're about to uh, begin our approach into Kansas City. Looks like we're, we're going on a 338 heading, but landing 18 down here. The winds at 270 at 6. Let's uh, pick up the whole ATIS real quick. 353 Zulu. Wind 270 at 06. Visibility 10. Sky condition overcast 1 1000. Temperature minus 0 2 Celsius. Dew point minus 0 6 Celsius. Altimeter 2 Niner Niner 0. Remarks density altitude minus 600. All right, we got our ATIS in Kansas City. Well, I'm hungry. <laughs> Looking for some breakfast as soon as we get there. Our dog with us, uh, me and my wife, and we're going to drop her, off, drop the dog off at my sister's house, and hopefully they can go get some breakfast. So I've got the airport inside up here, uh, New Century's airport. The city approach hasn't turned me over to him yet, so we'll begin our descent here in about three minutes. Uh, we're at 4,500 feet right now. Uh, just got to get down to pattern altitude, 2,500 feet. So we only need about five minutes to get But uh, so far, it's been a really good smooth flight. There's some weather off to our west and quite a bit off to our east. By cloud formation and icing. But uh, thankfully, we haven't gone through any of that this morning, which has been great. My name's uh, 80 Bravo, begin your BFR descent. All right, beginning to descent, 80 Bravo, thanks. My name's 45 Juliet, descend to maintain 4000. 4000, 45 Juliet. All right, to begin the descent, we're going to go ahead and pull our throttle back to 21. Everything else is the same. We stay 2500 p.m. and make sure it'll stay the same for the time being. We're down to 21.0 in the RPM. Want to keep those temperatures relatively good. Sweet pot. That's snow. <laughs> oh, I was finally seeing the snow and icing all around us. Asking about it. So the sweet spot for a bonanza is 20, 25, 13. So in other words, on the manifold, 25 in the RPM, a 13 on the on the fuel flow. A pretty morning, very pretty up here in Kansas City. You can tell they've had quite a bit of snow because you can see a lot of snow on the ground. And approach Bonanza 45 Juliet has OGC in sight. Bonanza 45 Juliet, Roger fly heading at 080. 080, 45 Juliet. A little bit of traffic around the airport. I, I believe they've got a school up here, so they're training quite often up here. I've got some traffic ahead, about five miles, but uh, I think they'll be well past us. They're going, uh, ATC just gave them a 080 heading, so they're going east, cross over in front of us without a problem. But, uh, yep, we're getting to see our son today. He's been in college up here, plays college basketball for Mid-American University. Uh, Mid -America, MNU, Mid American University. Go to my sister. Bonanza watch 8 0 games. Bravo, Raider Service Terminator, Squawk Maintain BFR, contact New Century Tower 133.0. 33 0 Squawk and BFR, thanks for the help. 8 0 Bravo, good day. 
ahead and get ground loaded up in here. Good morning, New Century Tower, Bonanza 6980, Bravo. Uh, we are about uh, 10 miles to the south, planning left downwind for 1-8 with weather. Bonanza 6980, Bravo, New Century Tower, Roger, report three miles to the southeast, Re expect a left downwind 1-8. All right, report uh, three miles southeast, we're going to be going to uh, Advanced Jet Center once we're down. Roger, thank you. November 5, Charlie Hotel, runway 1-8, clear option. Clear the option, 5 Charlie Hotel. Where'd that traffic go? 100 feet above us. I'll see them. They passed way off ahead of us, so we didn't have a problem there at all. Stay in Kansas City. I sure like this airport, Advanced Jet Center. They're nice to us, and... Uh, Always do a great job. They they allow us to use their uh, courtesy vehicle quite frequently, which is great. Uh, obviously, we buy our fuel from them as well, but they always take really good care of their uh, take a really good care of their pilots. So I appreciate them a lot. And check. Win two eight zero at seven. Thank you. Yep, no problem. Did you want to switch to 3-6? Yeah, after this one, can we? Try it out. Absolutely. Uh, so just on the go, I just expect a teardrop back to final to 3-6. We'll expect a teardrop back to final for 3-6, five Charlie Hotel. Been at the 6 9 8 0 Bravo. I'm going to switch to runway 3-6. How far to the south are you now? I am... Uh... I'm right upon you, actually. I'm about three miles. Can I take uh, two two? Okay, yeah, eight zero Bravo. We'll report the left base for runway two two. Then. All right, we'll report left base two two eight zero Bravo. Thanks. All right, let's. The new approach here. We're going to go procedure. Visual 2 2 with vectors. Activate. Beautiful. All right. Landing checklist, seat belt, shoulder harness, seat backs, yes. Fuel selector, yes. Landing gear. Okay, very good. Eight zero Bravo, left base two two. Bonanza eight zero Bravo, Roger runway two two, clear land. Clear land two two eight zero Bravo, thanks. All right. Five Charlie Hotel. We're going to go like mile and a half, two miles, and then do the teardrop come back in. November 5, Charlie Hotel. That should work out great. Thank you. Bonanza 8 0 here on runway, uh, or excuse me, at Texway Alpha. All right, we'll expect that 8 0 Thanks. All right, gear down, three gearing approach slaps are set. Everything else looks set. Once we get our finals, we'll full flaps, of course. Just a concrete plant or something underneath us here. 500. 500 feet call there, so we're turning final now. Go mixture bridge, prop full forward. Thirteen forty would be our minimum to call. Bump 
Bumpy. Minimums. There it Minimums. Is. Go full approach flaps. Bumpy this morning. And five for Charlie Hotels back on final. November 5, Damn, Charlie Hotel, cool. Roger, runway 36, cleared option on the go. It'll be right closed traffic. I do have traffic over the numbers, 2-2 two, two landing. 36, clear for the option. Traffic is high. We'll expect a right turn. Charlie Hotel. Charlie Back pressure on, let's take pressure off that front gear. Go ahead and lean the mixture a hair. Tower, I can 180 here if it helps you. Uh, negative, sir. Right turn on Alpha and then a right at Bravo. Hold short runway 36 and cross 36 without delay, please. I do have a uh, short file. Hey, firm, I got that traffic. Cross the 36. Eight Bravo, clear three six on Alpha. Bonanza eight zero Bravo, Roger. Uh, right turn at Bravo, hold short runway three six. Right turn at Bravo, we'll hold short three six eight zero Bravo. Thanks. All right, clean the plane up a little bit. Welcome to New Century. I like the Kansas suburb, Kansas City actually. We're going to be able to see our older son today, and we're going to see my sister and her whole family. They live in Kansas City. So we're going to sit with them, watch the Chiefs game today, and then head home tonight. For Chiefs. I got a bunch of Chinook helicopters over here. It's pretty amazing. One of our neighbors, uh, old son. And I are just seeing you now. I should have. Um, I think we're the only ones in the better now, but there are quite a few flocks of geese that were just over the airport, and it looked like there was more off the east headed this way. November 5, Charlie Hotel, appreciate that. Thank you. I'll uh, be on the lookout. Bonanza 80, Bravo, right turn at Bravo, cross from way 18. Right turn, Bravo, cross 18, Bravo, thanks. And tower 30851, ready for takeoff, runway 22. Good no, 30851, New Century Tower, runway 22, clear for takeoff. You said you were southwest bound? Uh, yep, southwest bound, uh, just in the practice area, and then we'll be back for 30851. Right. And takeoff, runway 22. because I don't want it to frost up for a night flight. Up top is off. Grab the dog and the wife and hop in the car. Get some breakfast. All right. Checklist. November 5, Charlie Hotel, runway 36, clear action. Good switch to ground. There we go. Pull up right next to a nice jet here. How about that? <laughs> Love it. I know I pulled the prop back. All right, let's clean up things a little bit. Are off. Masters are going. Avion Master is going to go off too. A flaps to open. Mixture out. X off. We're there. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tonight, hopefully, on the next video.